What you learn here will last you a lifetime. Several, if you're talented. I I've made myself rather clear. Yes, of course. I'm simply trying to understand the reasoning behind the decision. You may be used to the Empire bowing to your every whim, but I'm afraid you'll find the Thalmor received no such treatment here. You are a guest of the College, here at the pleasure of the Archmage. I hope you appreciate the opportunity. Yes, of course. The Archmage has my thanks. Very good. Then we're done here. Welcome to the College. Another new student. I'm surprised at how many of you there are lately. Well, first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I'll give you a brief tour, and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? Wonderful. Please follow me, and don't wander off. The College of Winterhold has been a fixture in Skyrim for thousands of years. The prominent feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. The Arcanium is located above the Hall, and the Archmage's quarters above that. While technically in charge of the College, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Unfortunately, we've had to implement more stringent entry procedures due to some problems with the local Nords. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. Our newest members are housed here, in the Hall of Attainment. I'll ask that you please keep your voice down while inside, as others may be working on research or delicate experiments. Now I'll show you to your quarters. You're going to be sharing space with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. This is where you'll be staying. This bed and desk are yours. Please try and be considerate of others. Now, let's go back to the Hall of the Elements, where most of the members gather for lectures and study sessions. strength again I'll be home may your neck lead then you have my steel you have a grim look fine let's trade then Lead us to our next task. Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards.
Tolfdir is likely already addressing the new apprentices. Go on in, and if you have any problems, let one of our senior members know. Please don't bother the Archmage unless it's absolutely necessary. Well, that depends on what you're looking for. Veralda can teach destruction spells, and offers training in that school. Finnis is one of the best conjurers in all of Skyrim, and can help with spells from that school. Don't let Tolfdir fool you. He's the preeminent scholar on alteration. One of the best in Tamriel, and always willing to pass on his knowledge. If you can find him and focus his attention, there's a great deal Drevis can teach you about illusion magic. And finally, there's Colette. She may be... difficult to get along with. She's very knowledgeable when it comes to restoration magic. There are no expectations. This college is a place to study and practice magic freely. Hopefully any discoveries made in your pursuits will be shared with the members of the college first. That way we all benefit. Another new apprentice, I see. Are you of the sort that believe you're here to change the world? Or are you only in it for yourself? I assure you that I shall be watching you, all of you, very closely. Your superior and I were simply having a discussion about my level of access to the college. Nothing you need to concern yourself with. I shall be quite capable of observing everything that goes on here. Your superior and I were simply... Well, perhaps that is why you're merely an apprentice here. Nothing you need to concern yourself with. Now that stability has been established between the Dominion and the Empire, we seek only to help Skyrim, to guide its people through this time of transition to help lead them to a better future. I am an advisor to the Archmage. The Thalmor wish to promote relations with your college. I am at the Archmage's disposal if he requires advice. Perhaps not as often as he should. In time, I believe he will be more trusting. just beginning. Please, stay and listen. So, as I was saying, the first thing to understand is that magic is, by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. Sir, I think we all understand that fairly well. We wouldn't be here if we couldn't control magic. Of course, my dear, of course. You all certainly possess some inherent natural ability. That much is not being questioned. What I'm talking about is true control, mastery of magic. It takes years, if not decades, of practice and study. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Please, please. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Eagerness must be tempered with caution, or else disaster is inevitable. But we've only just arrived here. You've no idea what any of us are capable of. Why not give us a chance to show you what we can do? You've been quiet so far. What do you think we should do? Well, your classmates certainly seem to disagree with you. If we can take this into him, we can do it. Just give us a chance. All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, We'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. I'll teach you all a ward, and we'll see if you can successfully use it to block spells, all right? Would you mind helping me with the demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? That's what this lesson is for, 
perfect time to try it out. Now, if you'll just stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you block it with the ward. Here we go. Over there, please, just opposite me. Wouldn't want... else in the way. Now, cast the ward spell and keep it up. You have to keep your ward up or else this won't work. I don't want to hurt you. Over there, please, just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Now, cast the ward spell and hold still. Excellent work. Well, I think this is an excellent spell. I'd like you all to continue practicing with ward. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthor nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. I suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all for now. Thank you. Before you even ask, yes, I have an ancestry steeped in magic, and no, I don't want to talk about it. Yes, I know Winterhold used to be full of my kind, and no, I don't care that they're all gone now. Does that cover everything? I've just been asked enough questions. I'm here to learn not to explain myself over and over. Forgive me. I didn't mean to assume. I know I don't like the way he looks at me. I can't tell if he expects me to blow myself up or to try and murder him, but he clearly doesn't trust any of us. Why? Because it's old and full of dead things? Clearly you've never spent any time in Morrowind. Not really, just that it's very, very old. It was one of the first cities of men in Tamriel, I think. <laughs> Good to see Skyrim still has such fine people. You give an old man hope. We're particularly interested in the prevalence of magical seals placed on the tombs here. It's rather unlike anything we've encountered. Anything. Anything at all that might be of interest. That's why I adore this location. We have no idea what we're going to find. And if along the way my message about the dangers of magic should happen to sink in for a few students. That would be a happy coincidence. All right, 
Please stay close to me while we're inside. It should be safe, but it's always better to be cautious. I find it hard to believe this excavation was approved. New here too, eh? It's good to see another Nord. I feared I'd be the only one. Almost doesn't feel like Skyrim, being so far away from the rest of the world here. Magic is shunned by most. If it can't be swung over your head and used to crack skulls, most Nords want nothing to do with it. Magic is seen as something for elves and weaker races. I'd better get going. I find it hard to believe this excavation was approved. No. There's no chance anyone in authority approved this. Our ancestors should be allowed to rest in peace. Hopefully, we can learn something from the experience. How the ancient Nords used magic. Maybe even what happened to this place. I know he's from the Thalmor, and that he claims to be here simply as an advisor. I also know that no one really believes that. I've been trying to avoid him, honestly. Well, look at the evidence. Nords generally don't trust magic, so it's not off to a good start. Throw in the Oblivion Crisis, which was caused by magic users, and the troubles now with the Aldmeri Dominion, who are elves and magic users. And finally, take the fact that the college is the only thing left standing after most of Winterhold was destroyed. It's all fairly damning. Until next time. Well, are there any questions before we begin? Ah, yes. Hmm. Well, why don't you see if you can assist Arniel Gain? He's one of our scholars, here working on cataloging our finds. I expect he'd appreciate some help in locating any additional magical artifacts here in the ruins. Any enchanted items will do. The usefulness of the enchantment is irrelevant. If you find anything, the class can look it over. Now, let's see. What shall we have the rest of you do? Brelina, my dear, why don't you search for warding magics? Anything designed to keep people out. Don't interact with them, just identify them. All right, everyone. Let's be careful, but have fun. Have you mastered the expert level destruction spells yet? Is it? This is disappointing. Jezargo hoped there might be one who could keep pace with his accomplishments. Oh yes, Jezargo hopes to find things that will make him a more powerful mage here. Hopefully small things that fit inside pockets and will not be noticed if they are missing. Because Torfdir says so, he says there are things to learn here. Oh, but you are wrong. The only reason you could disagree is because you are losing so badly you cannot see it. There is much for Gisargo to be sure of. There is skill in magic, there is charm, and there is a strong will. Gisargo will be successful, of this there is no doubt. Swift handing. Can you imagine what it was like living here so long ago? The first men in Tamriel. Here. Treasure here. Something to make Jezargo a powerful wizard. The 
Please be careful here. The site isn't entirely secure. Don't touch anything! He asked far, far too many questions about my research. I think the Thalmor are trying to steal my work. I haven't told him anything, of course. What I'm doing is far too important. Can't breathe a word of it. What? Ah, yes, you. I remember you. You're going to help? That's fine, just... Just don't make a mess of my work. I've only looked through a portion of this section. You, uh... You can look around in the chambers just north of here. Try and be careful, all right? We don't want to damage anything. Just round up the rest of the magical artifacts so that I can catalog them. Uh-huh. What in the world was that racket? Is everything all right? How in the world did that happen? Really? Perhaps the amulet is important somehow. Is there some way you can use it? Be careful here. The site isn't entirely secure. Well, would you look at that? This appears to lead somewhere. Let's see where it goes. this place. Hmm? Hold, mage, and listen well. Know that you have set in motion a chain of events that cannot be stopped. Judgment has not been passed, as you had no way of knowing. Judgment will be passed on your actions to come, and how you deal with the dangers ahead of you. This warning is passed to you because the Sigic Order believes in you. You, Mage, and you alone have the potential to prevent disaster. Take great care and know that the Order is watching. I... I swear I felt something rather strange just then. What just happened? I'm afraid I didn't see anything. Can you tell me more about what you saw? The Sigic Order? Are you quite sure about that? That's very odd. And danger ahead? Why, that doesn't make any sense at all. The Sigics have no connection to these ruins. And no one's seen any of their order in a long time. Perhaps we should take a look inside these coffins. Now, please do be careful. Who knows what we're going to find? They were a group of mages with a history that predates the Empire. Very powerful, very secretive. 
No one's seen them in well over a hundred years. They vanished, along with their sanctuary on the Isle of Arteum. I have no idea what connection they'd have to this place. I have no idea, but it's fascinating. Assuming it's true, of course. The Isle of Arteum disappeared over a hundred years ago, and no one has seen them since. And yet now, suddenly, they've chosen to contact you. Why, it's intriguing. If nothing else, I'd take it as a compliment. The Sigics have only ever dealt with those they feel worthy. Mm-hmm. Closer inspection. I'd like to stay a while and examine this. You, however, should press on. See if you can find whatever this vision of yours mentioned. But if it is truly dangerous, be careful. Go on ahead. I'll be sure and catch up with you.
I totally f keep forgetting that fucking...
Team!